Hello and welcome inside the mine of Matt. And I've got a box of 3D printed parts here that I've uh, designed, including the mold case. So I'm going to do some more Lost PLA casting, this time with a 3D printed mold. If you want to see what I'm going to do, make sure you watch the rest of this video. Stay tuned. So if you've been watching my videos, you'll know that I attempted to do my Maker Coin in one of my last videos. And it didn't quite get in all the detailed sections. And I believe because it was completely passed through and I didn't really uh, take care of, of trying to get those impressions taken care of with the mold material. Got a couple of suggestions in some of the comments and I'm going to implement some of them today. Starting with, I've redesigned my maker coin. As you see, it's no longer passed through, and now nobody has to really try to figure out what it mom says because it says inside of the mind of Matt right on the coin now. So I designed that. I've got um, a pour basin, a couple of gates, couple of sprues, a couple of feed tubes or gates or whatever, and a 3D printed box. Well, how is it all going to go together? Well, that's what I'm going to work on now. So, let's uh, get to work. Okay, so I got 10 of them made up. I only got four of the mold shells made up at this point. They're printing right now, about two hours a piece to print. But I only got room enough for a few in the kiln at a time, so I'm gonna experiment and do these four first. And when it works, because I know it's going to, then I'll do the rest of these. So now it's time to paint a little bit of Plaster Paris around all the details. I think I'm going to glue them in this first and then start to make a, a nice little coating, getting all the detail. Then I'll fill the rest with uh, my 50-50 mix of Plaster Paris and sand. So I'm going to do that now.
All right, so my molds are filled. I got to let them dry. The sun is out, nice and shiny. So I'm gonna put them out, let them dry, and tomorrow I'm gonna pull them back out and get them burnt out in the kiln. So stay tuned for that video. This is gonna be a part two. Don't forget, if you like this video, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Make sure your notifications is on so you know when my next video is coming out. Check out all the links I got down in the description. And keep on coming back because there's going to be more inside the mind of Matt. Happy printing and be safe pouring. I got a mess to clean up now.